Hi, this is Nancy from InMotion. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the amazing color replacement brush. It's one of my favorites. It saves so much time when you want to quickly change the color of something. We'll change some of the oranges in this picture to blue. Select the color replacement brush in the toolbar. Next, click on the swatches down here. Doing that will open up the color picker. Select your choice and click OK. It's useful to really zoom in on your picture so you can make a more accurate selection. Click on the magnifying glass, the plus here, and then the picture. Select the color replacement brush again. Photo P may pop up a message that says smart object must be rasterized first. So click OK. You can go here at the top to change the size of your brush. Mine is a little bit too small. If you right click, then the sizing options will open up. I advise going around the outline of the thing you want to change first. So choose a brush that's not too big. I'll speed this up a bit. Once you've finished the outline, you can then switch to a larger brush and fill in the gaps. You can click and create patches of colour or drag the brush around. You may need to go back and forth a few times, varying your brush size. I think it might be fun to colour this half of an orange too. Let's do it. Now you see here, some of the blue has gone into the green background. There's a simple way to fix that. Select the eyedropper here, then take a sample of the green. As you can see, it's loaded into the color swatch. Then go back to the color replacement brush and paint over the area. You can look for other areas that may need touching up and use the same process. That's good enough for now, but when you do it, you can spend more time getting everything to look just right. Well, I don't know how tasty these blue oranges would be. I guess they'd probably be eaten by a character like this, an Andorian from Star Trek. Anyway, if you found this video useful, please like it and subscribe. I'll see you next time.